All right, guys, how's everybody doing? We have uh, part four of the Team Affinity slash just pack openings that I've been doing since I've been going through Team Affinities. Uh, I have like a uh, last time I believe I showed you I had every uh, Team Affinity through stage one, so I have uh, everything completed above uh, the 70 stars. So I'm on stage two for everybody now. And I'm slowly working my way. I've been doing a couple of uh, showdown runs. That's how I've been getting some of the packs that I've been using to open. Um, so let's go through. I have eight silver packs. I'm going to start with 22 show packs, uh, 21 team affinities. And then we're going to cap it off with a live series pack and a gear up pack. So I'm going to go into uh, the silver packs first. If I can get a gold out of one of these eight, that'd be a dub. But um, it probably not going to happen. It's only a uh, 1 in 50 chance, so that I will take my chances and my luck over on the Team Affinity packs and the regular packs on that 1 in 50 odds, so I can get a, um, a, a diamond. I don't really, I'd rather have a diamond than a gold. <laughs> so, uh, all silvers, all decent silvers, so I could sell those, like Paul DeYoung goes for a decent amount. Um, we have the exact same amount of pretty much I, I have one less team affinity pack um, but we'll hop we're gonna go back and forth so we're gonna start here Tom Murphy whichever one pulls me a diamond first okay gold so we're starting with a gold in the team affinities I'm just kind of comparing the packs obviously they don't have they say that they don't have different odds but team affinities feel like they're better for whatever reason I, I don't know why I've had better luck in my Team Affinity packs than I have in Show packs. Um, I've pretty, pretty much pulled all of my diamonds out of Team Affinity packs, um, as well as guaranteed diamond packs. There's a gold equipment so far. Only one gold um, pulled so far. Uh, ooh, that was terrible. Okay, Braden Bishop. Go over to the Team Affinities. Alex Reyes, I hate Alex Reyes. His 88 diamond sucks. He's so bad. A gold here, Yoli Gurriel. I should quick sell him. He doesn't go for anything. But um, Nick Hunley here. So I've been doing a lot of showdown runs. I, I was playing online a lot. I'm, I'm trying to get a video out for, um, for all the three bosses as well as... Um, Willie McCovey before I get Eddie Murray who I wanted on my team but um, I that new event the part two I only need six wins and I hate it I hate quick counts they're so annoying um, I should have got the 40 wins before and recorded that stuff but I was just kind of playing and, and, and chilling and like watching YouTube and stuff while I, was, while I was playing the event before in the three inning games I didn't know that the new event was going to be six with quick counts, so a gold right here. JD Martinez, a good gold. Wow. Okay. Um, but yeah, I, I I will get out something for the 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 three new bosses before the fourth inning comes out. Um, by the way, the fourth inning is going to be uh, King Felix, Felix Hernandez, Joe Torre, and uh, Jacoby Ellsbury. So those are going to be like 95s or 96s with um, prestiges that are going to go up to like 90, 97 or 98. Uh, just based off of how the programs have gone so far, it went um, the highest was 93, and then it was 94. So um, we should be getting, like I said, a 95 or a 96, it depends. Last year they went from the highest was a 98 signature, and the other two were 93 and... 91 to on 399s in the third inning so we don't actually know they're trying to keep hold back the overalls this year um because people thought the uh 99s came out too fast last year but um uh so they've been trying to trying to restrict them okay we're about halfway through or a little bit over halfway and we've got nothing but two golds and one out of each pack <laughs> so um we need a couple more colds at least these are dry these are dry okay we've had two dubs of an of a pack opening so far and one stinker 
And it looks like we're going to get a Stinker again, out of the regular packs at least. Hopefully we get a decent Live Series Diamond. Um, now that that's from the XP Reward Path, obviously. I didn't get that through Team Affinity. Um, I'm really waiting to get all these Team Affinity packs. Uh, and then I want to do a huge Ballin' as a Habit pack bundle. Um, where I open like 20 of those, I would say. Hopefully. Um, because that, that would be a really fun, really, really fun video. So, oh crap, I, I opened out of order. That's okay. We'll just open two of these in a row. Yelmer Sanchez. I'm kind of surprised he hasn't been picked up, considering he was a gold glover last year. Alright, another gold, a Zach Granke. I'm sorry, we've gotten three golds. Um, I can't remember what, what JD Martinez was out of. But, um, oh, a cookie. Hi, cookie. How are you? Okay, so we got two bad golds and two good golds. So, um, not, not worth it this time around. That sucked. That sucked bad, but we'll get some stubs here. Uh, we'll go into the gear up pack first, obviously. Um... Let's see, what did I get? Let's go with the, the Harpers. Those sold last time, so um, pretty fast. So I'll go with the Harpers. Um, cleats tend to sell. Um, okay, so we got an 85 or better, obviously. Uh, live series player, so let's, let's come on. Get this, just, just give me a good one. I, I, I'm the only good pull I've, oh. I didn't know it was a choice pack. All right, well, I have Javi. Man, I did not know that this was a choice pack. Okay, well, I guess I will take, um... I'll take Hater. Oh, that... <laughs> I didn't hype that up at all. I thought it was going to be a, um... I thought it was going to reveal it. Oh, no. <laughs> I had no idea. I had no idea. That sucks. That sucks so bad. I mean, I got 20k, so that's actually a, a decent pull. The best uh, pull out of there was Mookie. Um, but we got, let's see, how many stubs from today? So 23k. 23k. I've pulled Hater like five times. It's honestly ridiculous. Um, <laughs> how many times I've pulled Hater? Oh, it's non-sellable. Well, that's even worse. I forgot. Man, this is a huge L on my part. Does it say non-sellable and I forgot because I've been saving it? Yeah, it does. Okay, that's my fault. I didn't look before I did, before I did it. Thank God I took him. Um, I guess that, that does help towards... Um, Where's the Brewers? Um, that does help towards getting uh, Dan Plesak, and um, I guess I could go and try to use him in the event, because uh, in the central, that's all I need out of those cards, and I could get Willie Stargell. I might end up going and doing that just to finish that up. Let's see how much Yelich is going for. I think like 40k. 36. And it would have been nice to pick Yelich. Um, I was waiting to do some of these collections because I wanted to see... I guess I could have taken uh, Kirby Yates too, but he's not as expensive anymore. And I've pulled him like three times as well. Um, I've Every time I've went and pulled... or went and bought a relief pitcher, I've pulled Kirby Yates. And um, that's how I got Rob Nen and Eric Gagne. Because um, I went and... <laughs> I went and sold those two to go and get him, or sold the Kirby 8s that I got at the time to go and get them, and they were going for like 30k, but um, uh, yeah, that's that's all I have for you, I got about 40 packs, um, I hope everybody has a wonderful day and has better pack luck than I did today, and peace.